Attention all units, this is Sergeant Stadenko. Attention all units, this is Sergeant Stadenko. We are changing from a Code 3 direct pursuit to a Code 347. Completely lost due to incompetence. Delicious again, Peter. <laughs> well, welcome out there, Manchester, to another edition of a live Manchesterdam. And it's uh, a little nippy out there, but uh, we're New Englanders. We can uh, toughen it up. Uh, we've got a lot to talk about uh, tonight, and uh, we're going to do that in a couple of minutes. But it's uh, Wednesday night, like I mentioned. I'm here with the usual uh, characters. I'm here with the uh, with Don T. Tibbetts and my good, uh, great friend, uh, Peter White. And I was being should speak. we uh, announce the guests or do that a little bit later? Well, well <laughs> we can announce our... Uh, I think most people know I'm here. Hey, well, Jeff Scumpy's on. Lorenz, as known as the infamous Scumpy. Yes, sir. Love you all. Love you. I love these guys. So, uh, right off the bat, gentlemen. Yes. we got to talk about the Super Bowl. Right off the bat. Well, uh, right we off the bat, it. we'd love to talk about the Super Bowl because it is a mystery. Very, very. A mystery. Well, Peter, How did it happen, Moose? Everybody well, I'm going to tell you. Peter and I, that night, were at the pint, and it was great food, great beverages, and and we're, and it, at, in the third quarter, it was 24 to 10. All of a sudden, Patriots go ahead, and 24 14. And I'm going to tell you something. I was, I just couldn't believe my eyes what happened. I'm With telling last, you right now. I'm telling you right now. The mystery of the Super Bowl. Did the Colonels do it? No. 
He was doing fried chicken. Did Sara Lee do it? No! Because nobody does it like Sara Lee. But what happens? <laughs> what happens? Who's the culprit? Who is responsible? The butler. The butler on the field. It's, That's a, it's definitely the a who done it. Who done it? The, the butler pa- did it. The Patriots should have never won that game. Never out there. <laughs> I, I know. I, I was know. furious the, the way that <laughs> game ended. But and every they Patriots won. fan, I agree. They won. They did it, and they, they won. They won. Every Patriots, everybody, Seattle fans, I mean, they knew it was a, it was Seattle's game. Come on, you don't run the Joel's best, favorite best guy, running back in the world. You don't pay it to him. Joel's favorite guy in the history of Crazy. football is the guy from the Jets that tripped that player as he was running by. Oh yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> but you know what? But who really won Stone? the game? Did Patriots win it or did Seattle lose it? That's what I'm talking about. Well, Seattle lost. Woody the game. Seattle Hayes? lost it. It, Pages didn't win the game. Seattle lost the game. Second goal on the one yard line. Seattle had one time. Yeah, we all left. know what happened. Okay? You give it a ball. Mashawn, Mashawn, and Mashawn. Three times you give the ball to the guy. Okay. He's oh, like yeah. a beast. And, and still a timeout. And, and what do they do? Pete Carroll thought. He, he said, well, I'm going to throw it in. Everybody off guard. He thought at that moment the Patriots would not know. What the hell was going that on? Guy, Butler, he and when he came he back, that thing, Butler moved around, came in. He knew the play. You can watch it slow motion. He knew the play. Oh, he intercepted. And all I can say now, is what a lot of people, Butler did it. What a lot of people don't know is that the Pete Carroll used to coach the, coach the Patriots. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, most yeah. people around here. At least, he, at least he finally got them a championship. <laughs> all right, everyone talks about cheaters too because uh, that's you know, very uh, nice of you. Patriots are known for cheating and all mind. that stuff. But I don't mind T. You got the tuck oh, rule, then you got the then you got the spy gate, and then the, the, the flight of balls. It didn't matter if they played with the shoe that they were going to beat right. you know Indianapolis but, anyway. Oh, it's yeah. not I, no doubt about it. I just want to make it. one no. more comment, but it still it goes I along with the make, rest. They, they I want to say it again them. and again, and the Patriots had no right winning that game. Well, I like to tell you. They have no right you, They have no like right. They do because Butler made no a play right. on the ball. He, he read it. You, you watch it. So, I watched it over and over. Like, I from like an overview. You. What do you he, mean no right? I like That's to tell you. Man. It's a game. He, it's a, it's a game. he saw the quarterback's eyes. He knew where that was going. Butler, he it's just went game, right man. at it. And he, Today is Wednesday. Should have never thrown the ball. You're right. Today is Wednesday. He is so You run three times. Yep. Run one time. It's probably over. One time. Give me 20 seconds, it's over anyways. Now Tom Brady is up there, and I think you can agree with me now that uh, he's up there with some greats. Today is Wednesday. You're right. Today is hump day. They do get there. And Camel, who has the greatest humps in the world, says... (laughs) What day is it? That's right. I mean, Mike, 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 Mike. The butler did it. She's the one that called me and said, tell Moose... The butler did it. Hey, Camel, I'll see you February 28th at the Asian Breeze. Ah, I hope there's a little A lot Asian of class with Brady. Yeah. Breeze. A lot of class oh, yeah. with Brady. And make sure you bring those puppies with you. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of class with Brady. He gave up the MVB, the truck, the, the Chevy Colorado. I yes. sell him a belt. No, that was nice. But, yeah, no, it's <laughs> great. Because if he didn't win the if, – if he didn't make that play – who gets the MVP if they score? Is Marsha someone on Seattle's getting the MVP? Wouldn't have been great. Butler deserved that that trophy for sure. The MVP. Oh, unbelievable! To make he, but he, he, to, he just the does thing Tom is, Brady though, does Tom Brady need another truck? No, no, exactly. not at all. But the thing is, or to read the play. <laughs> That's the thing. The kid read the play. He, he did, did the films before. He could see it. He knew what was happening. He read it for him oh. to jump in there and. Him. He oh, was on Good Morning America the next morning, and he goes, wow, right. I just want to thank, he was so humble, yeah. and he said, I want to thank uh, I want to thank the Patriots for picking me, because he no one else much, did. Right. He was pretty much a little practice squad guy, too, you know. No, yeah. yeah. They, he, oh, yeah, he's a rookie. He's, he's a rookie, like, he's like, rookie he's for like crying out. Like yeah. You know, yeah, even though Butler won the D2. MVP, but my, 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 my theory, it goes to its MVP through the team. 
Yeah, okay. I think so too. I think the whole team. I think so. But not just one I, player. I, 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 I think uh, I, they I think only the can give guys offense and defense. Yeah. The special teams. They only can a, give a, so a, many uh, Chevy. What if that uh, guy MVP. catches the pass though, and they score a touchdown? Now who gets MVP? If Seattle scores, well, it didn't huh? happen. Didn't happen. Didn't happen. That kid read the play, and uh, now uh, our friend Camel and her buddy Rosa. Always say the butler did it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's great. It is the butler did it. But but that the play, butler did it, the butler the did it. <laughs> practice it every time they practice. And Belichick, he well, he doesn't was matter. It. It's over. It's over no, now. No, it though. is. But, it, but the yeah, whole thing is Peter, over now. It, it's it's done. Deal. The Patriots won the Super Patriots Bowl. Patriots are the champions. Peter, it's the principle. It's the principle how the game ended in a shocker. It's not. Yeah, of course it was a but shocker. It's it's a shocker. shocker. That's what you want it to be. Put the shocker. I almost. Fell off the couch when they intercepted that goddamn ball. Should Seattle even have been enough to lose it to, to Green Bay? Green Bay lost. They just like oh, good. They, we got a call. They gave up. Well, maybe it's Gronk. It's unbelievable. Hi, yeah, for us. Amazing. Hi, yeah, for us tonight in Amsterdam. Um, yes, I'm trying to watch your show, but there's no sound on Channel 23. Oh, well, it's not us. It's Comcast. Oh, okay. Um, hey, you bastards. You can you. Well, we're going to send John Eric O'Neill up to the roof right now and check on it. So uh, stay tuned. Well, uh, okay. uh, Thank you. Uh, Thank you very much. Uh, if you're still listening, caller, uh, our director says it's a Comcast problem, okay. not, not Channel 23. Yeah, no, he's going upstairs to check it okay. now. He's going to check the satellite. Okay, thanks. Yeah. But, um, uh, where were we? Well, you I were trying know. to say that you were stretching out the reason why <laughs> the Patriots didn't win. And we are trying to tell you why it was a lovely ending to the game it really for the was, Patriots. So. And because you're not a, a fan, uh, we are fans, other way, and it, that's it. If it was the exact, exact, other, way. Really was the was exact other way and the same thing happened, but it was Seattle... That it happened. To I had a pull. You wouldn't be pulling this crap, Moose. I had a pull. If Seattle yeah. got a touchdown, no, I would have won some money. A lot of people Shut feel up. the way I felt after that. No game. one feels that way yeah, except yeah. people yeah. that don't like well, the Patriots. How do you sports, feel? Well, I sp like ESPN I and all the sports shows. You well, like like you got it was it. a heartbreaker for Seattle. Of course, it was a heartbreaker for Seattle. No, and people, uh, people if love they, to hit great teams. The Patriots didn't win. What about a heartbreaker for them? Oh, yeah. absolutely. Oh, right. so the Giants game, when the Patriots lost the Super Bowl to the Giants game, so well, you must have been, right. like, yeah. feeling good that time. Because they've been so good for so many years. How about no if you're way. a Steeler Both fan? Both of them. Yeah, How about if you're a Steeler fan? Yeah, no, the Steelers, it, it, people hate the Steelers. Around. They, they hate them because it, anyone The Steelers that's have won the most Super Bowls in history. Yeah. No doubt. And, and Bradshaw, they talk about uh, Brady. Bradshaw did it four Super Bowls in six years. And he probably would have won five if he wasn't injured. In, in different eight, different NFL, 76. though. Different NFL. You, different game. Then. You can't hit the quarterback down. It's watered down to. Back then in the 70s and the early 80s. Oh, they killed people. Yeah. Like, it's yeah so it was great down, to though. hurt people. Hey, I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill him. It comes down to a one penalty now. Dick it could be Buckus. the whole game. It's yeah. over. You know, don't get me wrong. The it was one of the greatest games ever. It was a good game. It was great entertainment. Yeah. And I just make, uh, it was 114 million people. The number one show ever, including MASH and everything else, that it, that the ratings were just off and the charts. And Debbie tracks. does Dallas. You know what I was well, thinking okay, during the halftime hey, show, that, guys? Really? That one more? <laughs> <laughs> no way. Uh, you know more. what I was thinking I during the halftime? I never even saw that one. You know what I was thinking during the halftime show? It is, you know, Katy Perry at the end, yeah. she's saying firework on that little tiny thing. Yeah. I want to put Joel up on one of those. I right, thought yeah. she did a great job. Hi, right, you're next to Adam Amsterdam. I like how they have the field going. Like yeah, that. yeah. I want to talk to uh, the Coach Tibbetts here. Uh, uh, coach, do you think it was uh, Belichick that the, the, he was a better coach over Pete Carroll? Do you think it was in the coach in here, Coach? Or what do you think, Coach? You are correct. Coach. Because he could have called a timeout and uh, <laughs> not let it happen. But he didn't call a timeout. He waited. And then the, the play happened, and then bang. I was thinking they would have called a timeout. I thought Belichick for sure oh, was yeah. going to call a timeout. Oh, yeah. Because if they go oh, in, yeah. he People needed time to score. People talk about that on every you, sports show. You know, that's a good point. Because if he called a timeout, oh, yeah. and then he got, what, 30 seconds left in the game, so the yeah. next play he spikes the ball. Yeah, yeah. So That's what they no, do. They saying, thought it was going to be incomplete. 
Yeah. So what? So what? What? So what? Because the game is over. It was played the way it was. Yeah. A lot of things yeah. could have happened. The game was over Buddy, Sunday. A, a lot of job. Even, a lot like of things if, could have happened, if, if, but if. they didn't. But you know, Patriots pull up. You know, if I if I got a hole in one and eighteen holes, I I shoot an eighteen. Okay, if right. <laughs> So why are you so Every angry? Sports, if he did this, if he did that, if he did why this. Why are you so angry happened. about the Super Bowl? Patriots won the game. And it was the, the outcome that the Patriots sh- the great defensive should never play. won that game. That doesn't even make sense. Yeah. It doesn't even make sense. No, I agree. I, I, they shouldn't have. But they shouldn't have won that game. Absolutely. But the, who did? They they did. Well, be, unfortunately, they, they did, did. because Pete Don't Carroll. Forget. Unfortunately, what do you Pete mean? Pete Carroll made a bad call, and that's just the way it is. If, if, it was a no, if, he, if, that could, if he completed that pass, yeah. he's a genius. Definitely. Oh, look, he, he got him off guard. It's a touchdown. He passed. They Don't thought he was running. It would have been, been a genius. It, it, but right. it didn't work. It goes but back, it it goes back to, to every everything that happened before yeah, the you catch. get to Don't the final the thing. Catch. It's it, it keeps going back. Yeah, the ridiculous you can't catch. You can't Ooh. say it's one play. That wins a Super Bowl or it loses so. a Super Bowl. It is so. It it's be one the game. You are fine. how the, the game play, goes. The play was stacked to the right. Wilson, if he didn't want to hand off to Mashawn, also he had to do was just run it into the left. They ran a pass because they knew they were going to try and surprise the Patriots, and what happened was they didn't surprise them. Butler knew the play. He read it. Cut right see. in. Watch that quarterback's ended eyes. Ended up getting a, oh, I mean, jumping. how did he get an interception? I thought it was going to bounce off him. He gets the interception. Bang. He could have there th- you go. He could have thrown that, he could have thrown that one foot more I mean, inside and the receiver Let's say this it. to Joel. Let's Next, somebody might have got in, if that, if that's a, a Let's uh, say this. Hold, in, hold, hold on for a sec. Uh, uh, you're no, next to no, I'm not going to hold on. I'm going to say, let's say this. Well, that guy shouldn't have caught that ball. What guy? Wait, the who's Seattle on? guy. Who's on? The, the you play that? before that See, play. Who's the play on the one the uh, That guy shouldn't have caught hi, that ball. Hi, this is uh, Sandy Paradise. I'm an ex-school board member, graduate of Central High School in 1955. Love Mr. Tibbetts. Always have loved him. Oh. Uh, I'm going to be 78 years old pretty soon. Anyway, um, I just wanted to mention... I res- I got a hold of a book at a yard sale. Okay. Um, a couple of years ago, and it was a story of Bill Belichick, right? Okay. Yeah. Did he Very smile in that book at all? I gave it I to bet- my grandson, who was a great athlete, Matthew Paradise from Central High School. Oh, Matthew. He's a golfer Paradise. right now. He's uh, studying golf, and he's also studying fire science down in Easter Florida State University. Oh, very Bill nice. Paradise from Hookson. Okay. Centralite. Graduated last year. Well, anyway, awesome. to make a long story short, I gave him the book because I was reading the book of Bill Belichick. It was very interesting. At nine years old, he was with his father doing statistics with his dad as a coach for a team. The man is very, very smart, very bright. And yep. I love football. My husband played for Bishop Bradley. Uh, he was an all leader wow. He signed with Milwaukee Braves in 1954. Wow. wow. He was wow. very thin and did not make the big leagues. But anyway, we're very much a sport enthusiasts in our family. Awesome. I'm a Bradley boy. A good athlete. I'm a Bradley boy. I understand that. As a grandchild. But it, the book is very interesting. If you can find the book at the library, if not, when Matthew gets back in 12 weeks uh, from school, I'm going to pass the book over to Mr. Tibbetts, okay? Oh, yeah, have him come on the show. Very interesting story of how he was brought up. I only read nonfiction, and I read about whether they're sports people, uh, all kinds of different people. I do not read, uh, you know, the average uh, book that's, Fiction, I read all nonfiction. I love the biographies, autobiographies. And it was very interesting. There's also a book by Joe DiMaggio. I think Matthew has that, too. Um, Joe DiMaggio put out a book, actually a book when he was younger, about him and his three brothers, how they were brought up and everything. Oh, yeah, that was a great book. Yeah. So yeah. I'm going to see if Matthew still has those. And, Mr. Tibbetts, I will get them over to you if he has them. 
Yeah, get those, get those books at Tibbetts. You remember he was a phys ed teacher. I might have to read them yeah. to him, but it, it'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get the gist. Well, well, weren't you? I'll put it on tape for the, you, buddy. Yeah, uh, person. I'm Central. I went to Central, graduated 55. My brother graduated 57. Matthew's mom Dubas. has D-D-I-S-T. got it going on. My uncle played <laughs> Will Dubas, was my uncle. Wow. He went to St. A's. He went to University yeah. of Lowell. He played for pro ball for a while and then uh, left. Hey, hey the show's only yeah, an yeah. hour. Uh, hey, hey, call him. When your son gets back, maybe Matthew uh, <laughs> would like to come on our show and he can tell all the stories <laughs> he likes. Oh, Just joking okay. with you, Matt's right. mom. Good. Yeah, oh, you probably love it. Okay. He'll That'd be, be back great. in uh, 12 weeks uh, from Eastern Florida State, and uh, he's got some tournaments. He you are, you are from now? Be, uh, he's in some of the world tournaments, junior world tournaments, because he's still underage, and um, he's been a great golfer he used to play soccer and baseball but then he taught himself how to play golf his freshman year in high school still can't you whip are, you are from congratulations you, still can't whip scumpy though coach. matt's mom uh, matt's mom this training down matt's there is mom. very hard though it's uh at cape canaveral what's that so very I good will, i will try to get him uh give you a call and matt's i mom. watch your program i love it thank you and thank you. i think the patriots were lucky thank you they were lucky. i think they just got the luck that's right. I, I, agree. I was at the hospital with my friend. I went into the other room. I you, thought Seattle had won. Horse you up the ass. Back. Don't we always say sometimes better luck than Thank you for calling. I went into the other room, and that's when Butler, you know. Yeah. Got thank the, you for calling. Smokes. See, don't we always say something? Like, everyone, God, some, you're better lucky okay, than thanks, good. Guys, oh, the thank you, guys. Okay, thanks. There's a lot, there's thanks. A lot of Same times that you can golf and everything. That you always lady. say better lucky good. How many times you miss it? You skull it. You skull that, a chip shot, and you, oh, you miss it. And it rolls up the hill, and it goes in the hole, and you go, oh, man, I missed that. That lady will, from now, better lucky be than ever good, known though. as Matt's mom. That's Matt Paradise's mom, everybody. Right. Correct, yeah. right? Do I know yeah. Matt Paradise? Yeah. Great caller. I don't think you do. He just graduated last year, oh, but he's a little green guy. Yeah. So Matt Paradise's mom, That's uh, we're going to call her Matt's mom from now on. Yeah, you can call in yeah. Mrs. Uh, Paradise. So. You can call in any time. Matt's mom. He has an exemption in the state of him. He does? Yes. No kidding? No. Uh, I know Peter wants to talk. About, okay, we're all done with football, correct? Yeah. Okay, let's move on. Let's talk well, about you. The, I, I don't know. Can, Wait, let's do can you Moose move on? Trivia. Oh. Yeah, Moose, moose trivia. trivia. Moose, moose trivia. trivia. Okay, Moose. Now, before we get into that, T, okay. is the band going on tonight? Yeah, I hope so. Oh, just me and him? Oh, yeah, we got to the thing. Right. So the band's coming up, uh, the house, Amsterdam House Band, uh, and you guys are going to release your new name. Coming up at 10 Who knows what it is? Of Yahoo. Yahoo! And, and Yahoo and plus, Amsterdam Band. And plus, Next gonna, week it might be something different, but. Plus, you're going to debut your new CD, I heard. <laughs> no, nope, it's not a CD, but no, it, is a, it is a song. <laughs> they have the Amsterdam that, like, you always do the. the it's like the. It's the Cheech and Chong. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. So he put a couple of words to it. And, uh, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, it's not acoustic and see. We're going to have people, people vote on it. People can vote on it. Maybe we'll change you know. it. Maybe no, we'll, we'll use know. the original. Yeah, ones. vote on it. Call up after. At 1030, we're going to yeah. debut something here. Do you guys need to, to, to do a sound check or anything yeah. like that? Nah. Ah, what do we care? Right, we're we're regular. Got, we got six we'll minutes. We'll mess it all up. It'll be beautiful. We got yeah. six minutes. Well, let's do Moose, Moose Trivia! Hi, Moose. <laughs> what is the national flower of the United States? A tulip. Bang! Your time is up. It's the rose. Oh, that was my second guess. <laughs> okay. Who is known as the father of medicine? Ooh, ooh the father of medicine. Um, Isn't that the guy that cured polio? I don't even know. Polio? That. Uh, the father of medicine? Yeah, he's the old Greek guy. Hippocratic Rates. Hippocratic Rates. I oh, that? Christ. You didn't, you didn't What's you the that? next question for the you, moose? You're way out there, no. Yeah, that's a real question. How many questions wow. are there? <laughs> 29. <laughs> okay. When you go right to 29. <laughs> yeah, we'll, when you're done, we'll, we'll guess your age. The traditional gift for a 20... Fifth wedding anniversary is gold, silver, or china. Silver. You are correct. Ding 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 ding. 
You got one right? Oh, yeah. Where is the Acropolis located? In In Maryland. (laughs) It's in Apples. Greece. (laughs) (laughs) It's Greece. Uh, Thanks, Captain. (laughs) I'm always trying to help you, pal. (laughs) Where was camel toes invented? Where do you get... (laughs) Right here in Manchester. I think it was, man. Oh, okay. On the First floor, floor, floor on the fourth floor of this building. I, yeah, probably. <laughs> Last question. That didn't make sense. Last that question. joke didn't even make sense. I know. Where do you I'm get... I'm not supposed to. In no, in but no, Joel, when he said, yeah, in this building. Yeah. The fourth floor they? of this building, Joel said camel toes were invented. What they? does that mean? Uh, uh, <laughs> I know what you... Tell us, Peter, what camel toes... Can the side of the camel toe and you go... Ha! 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 It's a sign of the camel. It's, 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 you know, when you... <laughs> I didn't know that. I'm glad you brought that up. Well, that's the salute for the camel, though. I did not well, know camels that. are getting... We should all get together and do it. Hey! Hey! Uh, whatever you say. What day is it? Where do you get the best <laughs> open face sandwich, turkey or roast beef? Oh, where? Wow. Well, wow. I'm going to save the pint. Bang. They don't even serve either one of those. <laughs> yeah, yep, she, John O'Neill just had a turkey sandwich. Yeah. No, not an open face turkey sandwich. It's it's if it's open it's open open it was closed. <laughs> it was closed. Yeah, it's open that gate open. Open arrow. Red arrow. For crying Who out loud. Who gives a rat's ass oh, if it's open God. a closed sandwich? You're going to eat it, yeah. right? No, no. You have to know which venue you're going to be eating, okay? A closed sandwich is different so than an it? open so sandwich. What is it, tea, anyways? It was a red arrow. Speaking of the best yeah. of, T. Oh, yeah. oh, that game closed. Speaking <laughs> of the best of, everybody, the Hippo Press is a uh, uh, thing is out there. Yeah, Here we go. You gotta vote for us. And please. I'll tell no, you I'm what. You, we just want to be chronicle once. We've got number two for two years in a row. And, and so, you know, if you can get out there and vote for it, you have to vote for 15 things. And, I mean, you know, you, you like Nick Valley. Do you like the Comedy Night at the Shaskeen? You, you can write whatever Def you want. Def Con and Head Shop, you can throw those in there? Yeah, no oh, yeah. kidding. Yeah, those bands. I'll Best TV them. personality, Scumpy, oh, oh, oh. Don Tibbetts. Myself, Joe Elber, uh, all these guys. Uh, How about the John Ever Cornell? That's bartender Don at the pint. Oh, oh one of our favorites. We love Don. Yeah, well, we my love daughter Don. Kim yeah. at yeah. back room. Oh, back room. Yeah, oh, easy. Back she room. wants to get in there. Yeah. Oh. Back room's still gonna win best chicken tenders. as they always do. Well, yeah, you can't beat those, man. Well, that's a yeah. given. Yeah. Even you know. if you had better chicken tenders, they'd still win. Yeah, my oh, brother's absolutely. a mental case. He comes back to Manchester and the Gotta first thing he watches is then. chicken tenders. I'm like, what the Good hell? Ice cream, you know, I you know I'm not into the chicken tender world. <laughs> you don't but like my him? brother is hooked like an addict. Like he needs. He's got to have it. You know what I mean? It's, yeah, but you like that frozen bologna yogurt stuff. That's what. Nah, I'm not into that either. <laughs> Thanks for asking. Though. What do you uh, eat, no. T? What do you eat anyway? Uh. <laughs> At the Y? You know, I, I, I'm sorry, but oh, geez, I'm so I was caught off guard no. on that. We Ooh, just give him a that uh, mustache. How do, you, how do you think I've been married <laughs> for 46 years? Yeah, the mustache <laughs> needs a little dusting <laughs> and cleaning. Oh, speaking of the devil. <laughs> Hi, Gary. How you doing? Uh oh. How many tonight? Gary, you're next. Hi, Gary. Hey, how are you? Good, good. You you wish you had some chicken tenders right now, I bet. Yeah, well, unfortunately, computer uh, errors down here won't uh, let me see the show tonight for some reason. Oh, oh no, we I'd said... We, and I thought I'd call in and... We put a... You guys uh, are shoveling out and... <laughs> Hey, yeah, we put a uh, we put a bug in your computer. Sorry, pal. <laughs> hey, Gary. <Yeah. laughs> hey, I was thinking about this, and 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 I was hoping that you're going to call tonight. Uh, I just want to know how's your twelve hundred dollar ear doing? Where the doctor just described Tylenol for you. <laughs> <laughs> I know, man. That is like. Can you? Please? I, I actually, I was so pissed off. I actually called the uh, the president of the, the hospital, and I filled his ear full. I was I was just so upset. I was, it's crazy. Yeah, yeah, you, yeah, yeah. Sounds yeah, when like you it. wrote that. I was saying, what? I mean, what, what's going on in this country? Gary, what are you doing tonight, anyway? 
How many have you had? Come uh, on, are you betting again? Actually, I was watching uh, <clears throat> watching a little TV, and then uh, my girlfriend came home from work and went over to see her for a bit, and then uh, I said, "Well, she, you know, she had, she had to uh, get ready because she's going to get up at four o'clock in the morning." So I said, "All right, I'm out of here," and then I uh, tried to get you guys up on the uh, computer and didn't. So I said, well, "I'm going to call you guys anyways." I'm going to say Gary's had zero drinks tonight. That's what I'm thinking, too. I think that's a lie, but Gary, thanks two. for still it's keeping us involved with a call. I'm glad you're doing okay. Uh, the Hanla Bunla is getting ready to go down to Florida to take care of uh, you know Roger and Anita, and uh, <laughs> I'm not going because uh, she's got too many uh, things to take care of, but thanks for calling. Hey, no problem. Uh, we saw your mom last week. Oh, I think he hung up. Yeah, we, me and Joel went over to yeah. T's, yeah. T's, T's mom's house. I saw a picture. Yeah, T's mother. That's awesome. We yeah. went over there. That's so cool. And we shoveled her out, yeah. and uh, it was fun. Yeah. Shoveling off so cool. the roof. She said we did it better than anybody. So. Yeah, that's right. We got banana bread. We got pumpkin bread. And yeah. I couldn't get off the freaking roof. I believe that. I saw that. You fell down. Oh, it was beautiful. Yeah, my <laughs> yeah, video, yeah. man. What was you with the book? It was the best. See, uh, oh, yeah. yeah. I go. Yeah, it was, was, yeah, was, was good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, big, I just want to say a big shout out to Janie T. She uh, was very hospital, uh, hospitable to us. Uh, she was great. Maybe get her uh, to be a guest Thank one you. of these uh, Wednesdays. Oh, Hi, you're next oh, tonight on Amsterdam. Ooh, baby. Hey, sorry, guys. What the, I don't know what happened, but... Uh, I just uh, lost you there for a bit. Oh, no, we hung up on you, Gary. Oh, T said goodnight. <laughs> you hung up on me. Yeah, T yeah, oh, said goodnight. Oh, See you I, tomorrow. I haven't had that happen to me in about 20 years. so that, that, No, that's we're cool. just kidding with you, but no, hey, no. How about, what do you think? These guys shovel off mom's back roof. They had a great time with her. Now they want to I'll bring her on the show. I what love the think? video. I love the video. <laughs> I love the pictures. It's awesome. Yeah, um, and I really appreciate you guys doing that for my mom. She was like, I just uh, talked to her tonight. She's still talking about it. She's the she's the matriarch of you guys' family, and I'll tell you what, she knows it, and it's like yeah. she she is a she is happy to talk about any one of you guys, any one of your kids. Maybe like she, she's she she loves everybody. Maybe she'll call the show tonight. I know. Oh my yeah, god, she's she's awesome. Yeah, she's she is. awesome. She. Uh, she she is a little disappointed that she left Florida so early. <laughs> yeah, she, uh, yeah, she mentioned that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What was the temperature out there today? Uh, I got up to like seventy one. And all right, right Gary. Now, right right now it's about it's about sixty five right now. No, that's Wait, still warm. That's what do you warm. think about having mom on the show and they start talking about the old days? Oh my god. <laughs> It'd be great. It's just you got to talk slow because she won't hear you. Exactly. That's fine, but you know what? Way. She's not yeah. crazy about getting her picture taken. So, no, talk about she's changing not. his diapers and the, the, the stuff we have to do now? Oh, we have to do. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> uh, no, man. Well, Gary, listen, Scumpy and T are getting ready to rock out in their new band, the Amsterdam. Uh, the Manstradam duet. Yeah. yeah. The Manstradam right. duet. We just, we just yeah. wanted to do we, we just wanted to I do can't thing. wait for you guys to put this show up on uh, YouTube so I can see see how it went. So, uh, hey, rock on, you guys, and uh, love the show always. Oh, All the best geez. to you. Okay, thanks. No, just best they, to you, too. They Gary opened up, the, they opened up with the Teach and Chong thing, and me and T, we made a little version ourselves. So we'll see Are you guys ready? Do you guys want to do it? It's 1035. Well... Well, while these guys are doing their thing, I just want to yeah. make uh, two points. Yeah, that's fine. Let them let them set it up. Uh, Friday, uh, I think it's the February sixth. Uh, it's hot. It's hot association uh, day. Um, we're red, and it, it's a good thing. Uh, it's it's, my it, it's a good. Um, it's a good thing. Hot, really. You know, association day, and. Saturday, if you go to the Monarchs game, everything is going to be pink for breast awareness uh, 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 night. So um, that's also uh, 
a very good uh, thing. So two things, your heart, your breasts, great association, and I just want to bring that out. So make sure you wear red on Friday and pink on Saturday. I don't know if you noticed downtown tonight here in Manchester, City Hall is lit up red. Really? At the crown of City Hall is lit up yeah. red. Which yeah. is great. Yeah, nice. So, uh, so this is going to be great, everybody. We got we got T and Scumpy getting the band together. Uh, it's going to be good. It's coming up in just a few minutes. I would uh, I would uh, you know do whatever you got to do to watch this one because it's <laughs> it's going to be good. Uh, well, let me introduce them. I think we're ready, Moose. Would you like to introduce the Amsterdam House Band tonight? Yeah, we got uh, we got on bongos uh, Don Tibbets and on the guitar Jeff Scumpy Lorenzo. Master Dam is true. We are all here for you. Master Dam, it's all right. We're here every Wednesday night. Call in if you can. The moose is always the man. Peter White, not uptight. Tea and scumpy till midnight. Show to tell the truth. We still all love Babe Ruth. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you do it again. Master Dam, it's true. We all here for you. Master Dam, it's true. We are all here for you. Yeah, it's true. We're all here. We're here for you. It's true. It's true. It's true. It's true. Those such goofballs. Thank you very much. Thank you very much indeed. And our next one. See you in a few more weeks. <laughs> <laughs> no, serious, because you guys whipped that up tonight, right? Yeah. That was great. It was most hilarious. This yeah, was your just... background. This was your background, man. I want to go sit in front of that background. I don't blame you. That was great. Yeah, did you see what the background was? That weird that, that's what, you guys were in that. We were in it, huh? Yeah, have you ever been there before, Scump? Ah, uh, yeah, you know, maybe the Grateful Dead show many years ago. Yeah. <laughs> selling, selling nitrous oxide and doing some weird things. T, have you ever been here? Uh, three times. Something to tell. He's there every week, man. man three times. The thing Joel has, I don't think he has. No. Uh, he's he's, yeah, he's, you, he's just you getting ever, out of that right now. Have you ever been to this place? Oh, man, you kidding me? That's, uh, that's Woodstock in the 60s for me. Well, I mean, like, Were you so, at Woodstock Moose? Oh, man, I was freaking tripping and everything else. No, so, he like, wasn't at Woodstock. Yeah, he didn't do the brown or whatever the stuff, oh, the man. bad stuff. Huh? Yeah, the he wasn't stuff, at Woodstock. Huh? Well, that was a good story, though. But we have to say thank you, John Eric O'Neill. I heard he was oh, I heard right. he made yeah, out with Janet Shopper and stuff. Yeah. Let's get it on, okay. Manchester. Yeah, didn't you have a thing going with Janet right, Shopper? Right, T? Oh, yeah. Let's get it on. That's right. Get it on! Maybe. Wow. Let's, um, <laughs> well, hey, very impressive, by the way. Uh, well, thank you. Uh, that's, a, yeah. that's the first version of uh, the Macedam. So I, I think people should call in and vote to see if they like that version or if we have to do another version. Yeah. Because we can do, uh, you know. Uh, well, we just did that 10 minutes ago. Yeah, say? you yeah. know, we just brought it up. I mean, we can do more, uh, you know, impact, you know, horns. You know, violins, you know, all that bring stuff. Bring musicians oh, and can play all kinds of leads and oh, stuff. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It'd be silly. I think next week I'm going to bring my tuba. They kept it simple for now. Yeah, if you I had one. <laughs> no, well, I have they a saxophone. No tuba. That's your girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> what are you talking <laughs> about? No, no, no. Oh, I might I have a tuba. God. 
Can you, can you, can you, no, you I can't, can't play I can, tuba. I can play some notes on the saxophone, but I, I think it's great. You play like tuba. To You're trying to tell me you play tuba. My high school days. I don't yeah, think so. I, I carry Yeah, he blows out of the... the most yeah, he tuba. Really? He is the tuba. He Come blow, on. He blows out of if his... If I nut. get you a tuba, are you going to tell me you can play it? I want to play for the head shop, so surprise I'll tell you. <laughs> I can get a tuba. I can get my hands on a tuba. I know you can. Yeah, yeah, most certainly. He no, just, can you play it? No. I yeah. knew you like He'd be like Peter Griffin or something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, out of his nose. Hey, you bastards. Hey, you bastards. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, let's get serious for a second. All right, what do we got? Okay. Hold the on Hope a thing is happening. Hope, New Hampshire, is happening the 11th of uh, February. And, of course, it's helping to raise money to support a youth program. Mentoring. Where you provide, uh, you know, uh, mentorships to kids and it makes them change their life. So this is happening on the 11th at the back room. And, uh, you know, 6.30 to 10 kind of deal. And uh, you, please, really, uh, it, this is a guy we had on the show last year who yeah. was started, he was doing it on his own. And finally, you know, he couldn't do it uh, any more money. So now this is the second year we're trying to raise money for it. And uh, if you all can, uh, you know, get involved, uh, that'd be great because it, it helps out many kids in Manchester. Just like you did, too. You're a mentor to That's what uh, I was saying. hundreds <laughs> of central And look kids. how good I show. You know. yeah, we all I came did. out great. I had it, man. We, <laughs> yeah. we all turned out great. Uh, no, no, it's, a, it's a good class. program, though. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we did yeah. though. Most of, come on, no, no, I, 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 I gave these kids head butts, and they're better now. <laughs> <laughs> it was fun though. That's yeah. you know you think of it now. Oh, those are the good God. old days. Yeah, you know, oh, those years. I tell you, I had a great time. Oh my freaking word! And I'm lucky. Uh, kids still respond uh, to the stuff I do on. Uh, uh, you know the, that Facebook stuff. I, you know, oh my I, God! Yeah, I everyone put, responds to him. I, I put yeah, a couple he, of videos he, he on it. He around, puts up a know? thumbs up, and all of a sudden, there's three thousand likes. Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs> Yahoo! He's the only one who can't uh, respond uh, anymore. Guy has <laughs> five thousand friends on Facebook. Oh my God! No, you see. Still have you so got a long way to go. Everyone loves you, T man. I love you. Still have fun, man. I really do. So much I have so much fun. How can you not love this man? You know. God dang. You know, that was a great song, guys. You, know, you have to be positive, and that's well, number one. Well, it's just your theme song. It opens up that way. I figure we do our own too. version there. Nice. And we learned it 10 minutes ago. That's not too bad. <laughs> I know. You guys <laughs> yeah. practice at the pint. Yeah. 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 We're about 10 <laughs> minutes. Yeah. Okay, I got it. Well, Patrick, I, I know. know. Really, if people call yeah. in and tell us if, you, you know, or. <laughs> we can always write I, I give two thumbs up. We can always write a new version, too. You know. Ooh. A nude version? Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll do it in the nude. You got the green screen. You can do whatever we want. I, no. That would be great. I'd love to do the nude version. Oh yeah, that'd be great. <laughs> yeah. I'd love to see what you guys do the weather, just the way they do it with with the green screen. Oh, we could do that. All right, just start pointing at people and poking people in the eye. Yeah. Hey, look at this! Oh, well, it's gonna be snowing up there again. Of course it is. You want to do the weather it. tonight? Hi, oh, you're next tonight on oh, yeah. Amsterdam. We'll do the what do we got? Good evening, gents. Uh, I got a feeling. Yes, sir. Do there, uh, Mr. Mr. Doyle. Doyle. Hey, let me ask you a question. Is there anything better? What's better than the Pats winning the Super Bowl? It's watching the, the guys Steelers who winning. hate the Pats do over the guys win the Pats winning the Super Bowl. Yeah, like ruins their you've got, day. You've got one of those guys sitting right next to you in a green shirt there, green sweater. Oh, uh, man, Mike, I was so furious at Don't that forget. play. I, I was like a wild Comanche. The butler. Oh, what, was, what, was, what would be better? The Jets winning, right, for you? The well, Jets? There's about, there's about 10 things you can go over in that game, but you be can't forget one thing. Thing. Seattle had the number one defense, and and Brady and the Patriots <laughs> carved them for two long drives in the fourth quarter to win that game. I can hear him in the the well, Butler did it. Largest, the Butler did it. The largest comeback ever in a fourth quarter against that D right down the field. Boom, boom, boom. I mean, you got to give some credit where credit is due. It was awesome. And that catch that the catch that was made there, the, the guy that hit his legs and bounced. Come on, that's a that's a one in a hundred catch. Oh, yeah. Unbelievable! Yeah, it really was. That the was highlights awesome. were unbelievable. Uh, 
Unbelievable Super Bowl. It just happened to go the Patriots' way, and we're it's excited good. about it. They finally got the fans. last play instead of losing you're to the Giants in the last play. Is that all? So you, 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 let me tell you, you hate let me tell you it. Good, what for them. Done. good for them. I would have faked the handoff to Lynch, and I would have had uh, the quarterback keep the ball. Do a little rollout. Those oh, all yeah. work. Now, he, he can do a little bootleg. Oh, dive for can, the goal line. Of course you can say ball. that now. He can find a tight end that just snuck out behind everybody. He can race to the pylon. There's so many things that can happen. But Of he's course he's you can say in. that. He's, he's not throwing it into a crowd. We well, all of course you can say that react. now. Everybody would have reacted to the fake to win. We all know sure. throwing the ball is a bad decision. Yeah, and that's right. why the you, Patriots are the winners. I think Scumpy the, said it best when he says, if the guy would have caught it and the Patriots didn't uh, it would have been a good call. Take it away, yeah. it no one would be like, saying, oh, oh he's the hero. The he's yeah. the hero of the Super Bowl. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> when you make the I wrong know. decision, it's always bad. You make the right one, it's your genius. You got to give him that dude, Moose. It's just, it is what it is. I mean, that two <laughs> he never will. Two long drives in the fourth quarter. Who would have thunk that? You know what I mean? Well, Against that defense. Well, you're and right. You them. I mean, you know, that's that's uh, that's a champion right there. That's all that is. And it's just, it's too bad it's not the J-E-T-S Jets, but they suck. And so, <laughs> well, let me that's ask, all there is to that. Well, let me ask you this, Mike. Hey, you Mike, doing? you being a big, big Patriots fan, you probably thought like everybody else did in this world. <laughs> 20 seconds left that the Patriots are going to lose. Everyone in the world uh, did. Everyone. No. I don't know. Actually, in the near the end of the third quarter, everybody that I was with, about 15 people were all down and out. I jumped up and started clapping and said, come on, we got a whole fourth quarter to go. That's and, what uh, my didn't, wife didn't did. Look good. I'll agree. It didn't look good at that yeah. point. But yeah. That's what my Just... wife did. My wife never gave up. I put on Facebook. I'm kind of disappointed. My wife was mental. She's going, we will win. We will win. And she kept going like that. And then what happens? Holy stinking smuck cloth. I was just we different. ended up winning. Whoa, did I have great sex. I told yeah. uh Anyways. I was talking hey, last thing. Dude. They're going to wait through the music and the psychedelics. Let us know so we can drop some black beauties or something. What do you want that background music on there? I'll talk to you later. I bet Mike thinks, like, I bet you during the 2001 Super Bowl win with the Patriots when Adam Vinatieri in the playoff game oh, yeah. against the Oakland Raiders hit that field the goal tuck, oh, in, come on, in the was, snow. That was a fumble. And in the snow. Was, and, yeah. and you were that probably like, oh, that's a great right. one. That was my favorite. Great one. Great, that was my great, favorite. great. Are you they kidding shouldn't me? have got that one for either. Out of control. That was, that was bull. I, I, I saw so many. That was better than the, the Super Bowl. Bowl. Come on. Oh, I've it seen that a million times. It's a fumble. It's a fumble. It's a fumble. How many quarterbacks you see get hit like that and the ball comes out? It's a fumble. Oh, there's a tuck rule all of a sudden. It's because of 2001, the 9 11 thing. Oh, the Patriots, that, that one was fixed. I, I have a question for you, Scumpy. I really believe that. Have you ever fumbled, Scumpy? Yes, I have. Tibbets? Oh, I fumbled. And they didn't every say, day. oh, because you were bringing <laughs> it back in, I could I've have also the ball back. Fumbled I, the ball. I fumbled myself on the way here. <laughs> <laughs> I fumbled and drooled. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you need a new truck? <laughs> Most, do you fumble? Oh, uh, Or did you give it up? Yeah, I conquered the habit. I don't fuck about <laughs> No, you hold on to everything. No. He, he just hits his head. His head. <laughs> no, no, no pusters. No. Says he could. No, I got a great girl that takes care of me. Peter, you <laughs> hold on to it all now, don't you? What's that? You hold on to everything now, don't you? Like what? You don't fumble anymore. I fumble. You just do <laughs> a little bit. I fumble a lot. Yeah. No, I catch a lot of passes. I'm not that guy. When they, were, they had a thing on ESPN... With the throwing of the ball to one of the uh, uh, receivers of the uh, Is that uh, Fitzgerald Seattle, Seattle, right? And he's going like this. One hand, this way, that way. Well, no it's kidding. Like that you got the clubs. Now. I mean, in the old days, Fred Belenikoff for the stick Oakland em. Raiders, he had stick him on his hand. Yeah, like, see that? Right. Boop. He, you know, he's throw, I don't care where the ball's up. They had a Boop. pass Belenikoff. You go, two little steps. Fall out of bounds. They, I mean, they had a bullet in the cup. There was one pass when they outlawed the, the stick him. Yeah, it was actually they, a pass. It hit him in the chest. He didn't even grab it yet, and it stuck to him, and he went, oh, <laughs> I got it. <laughs> I swear to God, and that's when they outlawed stick him. He oh, had yeah. so much oh, of it on him. That's the right. pass just hit him in the exactly. chest and stuck it. Oh, exactly. Got it. Exactly. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, yeah. Really? Oh. So oh, now, now, now it's the gloves. 
Now it's a glove. Yeah, you got the little cup. For, yeah. They have gloves for every type of weather. Look at that Giants guy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Odell Beckham Jr. Oh, yeah. He's unbelievable. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The guy, watch out for him. You're throwing him. They're throwing passes. Watch out for that guy. Yeah. He's awesome. Too true. Unbelievable. He's awesome. Yeah, he's uh, one of my... Yeah, and he's uh, a rookie. He's, uh, the, yeah, he's, he's uh, 23 years old. One of your what? He's going to be unbelievable. He's one of my favorite players. Even though I'm a, J- a J-E-T, I, yeah. I, you know, he's, he's one of my favorite players on the uh, Giants. Good, we got a call, call finally. We got a call, good. Hi, right, you're next to the on Amsterdam. Yeah, that was Lester Hayes, not Freddie Bolitnikoff. Mm, uh, I no, I don't know about that. No, Lester was Hayes. Was the, uh, no, Belinda he played Kopp. also, but Belinikoff was, was unbelievable. Famous for the stick him. Unbelievable. Lester Hayes, you stick him. No, Belinikoff, you stick him. What you kind of What for? era are you, sir? Come on, you don't remember Fred Belinikoff? Is that why you got a dent in your head? No, <laughs> you know, come on. Nice try. You can't remember Fred Belinikoff. Hello. Who did the call say? That guy? Lester Hayes. What the hell's yeah, Lester, Lester Hayes? He was defense. I never heard of Lester Hayes that played for. Uh, no, he was a Raiders for, dude for, too, wasn't uh, he? Oakland. Yes, he was defense. You know, uh, Volendikov was offense, but, but you know that's all. Oh, Steelers Raiders were big time rivals. So, I was, I was yeah. a young kid, but I, oh God, it was a great game. Uh, they killed each other. Yeah, those those days. That those was back when you get when you hit someone, knock their head off, and it was like, yeah, hey, great play, no penalty. Oh, good play. Yeah, and then you hurt the guy. Yeah, yeah, big deal. Right. We come back in with concussions and half blind. And now they're all suing the league. Yeah. <laughs> hey, seven more so. days. Catches and pitches uh, start arriving. And, uh, oh, right. my God. Yeah. Yeah, seven Did more you days. see the paper today? Wait a minute, one sec. Oh, go ahead. Uh, you're next tonight on Amsterdam. Check. Go on your computer. Uh, this guy just can't stand him. Okay. Uh, I'd go like to say that. Uh, you go on your computer. Cam House. Camel and, and, her, and her buddy Rosa. Rosa, they, they gave me a uh, article uh, 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 today in the paper, where uh, I guess up in Lee, New Hampshire, where where they have a nudist colony, there was a hole in the fence, and I guess the police are looking into it. <laughs> Is Gary still part of that? Uh, <laughs> the Gary? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Yeah, I'm not <laughs> yeah, they're all <laughs> Have you ever been? I know I like being camp in Lee. Have I ever what? You, 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 you drive by, everyone thinks the same thing. I think. It's it like, is. who's in there? What's that? It is true that Lester Hayes used stick him as well. Yeah. Oh yeah, a lot we of guys use stick him. We're not Back saying he doesn't use stick him. Stick him was used. Always that, you know, he always used it, but well, look at baseball. He used it to the I, point you know, where we're trying I mean, to tell you the truth over here. Well, you know? look at baseball with the bats. You can you can see their handles. I think it's what oh, uh, cork and bats and like all that like kind of four or five. That's so you can go like four or five inches up and that's what? it. Don't forget George Brent. Oh yeah, ballistic. One of the ba- one of the best uh, yeah, I love that. things ever. I also just read that the guy T mentioned introduced it to Hayes. Yeah, I believe that. He might have, yeah. I believe that. He introduced the, the, the Lester Hayes because Belenikoff was in there before, I tell you. And well, he I'll was famous you, for using the most. Great guy. Great but they guy. all used the The old then. snake days. That's when, uh, yeah, uh, who was yeah. the snake? Kenny Stabler. Kenny Stabler. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, the first guy. Now, nowadays, yeah, Casper, he was a nowadays he was, if he you was heard him great. talk, you go, why does he talk like Mike I Tyson? Because <laughs> he's got that, wee, 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 you know. You know, you think he's, here's the quarterback for the Oakland Raiders, and you think he's going to have a manly voice. Oh, yeah, he's oh, a no. same country western. Okay, oh, wait a minute, guys. Yeah, Hold yeah. up. Hi, you're next tonight on Amsterdam. Oh, okay. oh thanks for hanging wow. out. <laughs> wow. Well, we'd like to let you know that uh, the Rimmen Club is now uh, listening to Amsterdam. Oh, hello, hey, Rimmen uh, Club. We, we got a new one on the, uh, the thing there. Give a big uh, shout out to everybody. Like uh, we used yeah, to Michelle, we're that Michelle right said to say hi that from guy Frankie uh, McGarvey's. Guimon. The guy Frankie Guimon I talked about before. First, okay, uh, where's he first tonight? First night, the guy. He was the head greenskeeper up at Derryfield. Yeah, he's going to turn ninety. Okay. Friday the 13th. That's cool. God bless you, Frankie. Thank we you. love you, man. Hey, I Keep hope you'll remember baby. me. I know your son, too, you wise guy. Hi, you're next tonight on Amsterdam. I had to throw that out there. He's a great guy. Hello, guys. Good Guess night. who? The infamous Campbell is here. Oh, wow. It must be hump day. <laughs> yes, sir. Wait, 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 wait. 
Are you watching? How you doing? Are you watching the program with Miss Rosa? Yes. I also want to say nice piece you had there earlier, T and Scumpy. That was pretty good. But I know you can do a better job. <laughs> Keep on trying. Yeah. Well, we just we just made it up and like ten Celtics minutes ago. And the Celtics won so. tonight. The Bruins lost. Oh, that's a good thing. Well, Moose loves us. And we will be seeing T. He'll tell you where he'll be playing. And I expect to see you, Moose, at the breeze. I'll it's the camo saying, I'll yep, it's hump day. Oh, hump day at the Asian breeze coming up with a headshot. Wow. Moose, 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 what be, day is it? I'll be there, I'll be <laughs> there camo, on the, 20th, Peter, 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 what day? Oh. on the 28th. <laughs> wow. Hey. Hey, no, we're not going to run. Hey, uh, um, did you read a paper about your toilet paper shrinking? <laughs> oh, my God. Your yeah. toilet paper is shrinking every time Everyone's you go to the bathroom. Oh, Everybody's yeah, no, What the hell are you talking about? No, no there was an article uh, in back of the of the union lead about your toilet paper shrinking. You, you're getting... Um, it's about the squares are getting the more shorter. The squares are smaller. Not if you not go to Scott. They're not as thinner. You got to uh, go to Scott. 1,000 squares. 1,000. Have, have, have you ever counted that? No, because but, I, I'm busy. But wasn't, didn't one guy do it a couple of years ago when he was suing? Because he counted no. <laughs> 999 sheets. Wow. That's like the guy so that, yeah, ripped uh, off a sheet, huh? The kid that, uh, uh, you know, sued. Shit, him. man. I can't believe you get ripped off a sheet, yeah. man. Sheet. Yeah, yeah, it was right there. It's it's like like we're the only kid saying that, sheet. It's yeah, like, like the sheet, kid that yeah. sued Red Bull because he didn't get wings. That's a bunch of bullshit. Yeah. You know? They're making, <laughs> the, they're making, the, hey, they're making the toilet paper a Bull half sheets. inch smaller. So if you, <laughs> I'm, I'm serious. So up, call us out up there. Sheets if Creek. You're, if you're, hey, call us. <laughs> we go. got one minute See, out there. Yeah, if you're running out of TP, See, give yeah, us a call. You have to understand, I'm a fragile folder, so I don't use that much toilet Oh, paper. I fold mine very neat. Uh, you know, I'm not a basic buncher. <laughs> yeah, this, this bunch is I'm a folder, too. Much. And I'm not uh, what's the, uh, the worried rapper. I don't want anything on me. The girls do that, man. <laughs> okay, I'm just a fragile folder. I don't use that much. The, act, the actress, Ellie Sheedy. <laughs> That's right. That's why she probably owns stock in that stuff. The sheeties are getting smaller. <laughs> the alley sheeties are getting real tiny. I mean, it's like everything else. If you buy a pack of cookies now, they're shrink. Everything is shrinking. Well, I get the baker's dozen. But even it used to be a half a gallon of ice oh, cream. It's not a half a gallon anymore. It's, everything it's, it's, it's is sheets. Everything's small enough. Yeah, everything's sheets. <laughs> everything's sheets, Peter. Everything's sheets. What, are you getting she's a small Peter. fry? Or what are you talking yeah. about? Ah, everything's sheets. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, small fry? What are you doing everybody sheets yeah but everybody nobody sheets. does it like and they all look at it too and they go oh ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> scumpy and you never want to pitch it off too early because then you you know you get brown crane syndrome and you're wiping and wiping it's like wearing down a brown crane you don't want that stuff thank you guys for all rocking right. the we lounge it, yeah. tonight that was awesome as usual good we'll job. have it out loud good job guys and well, thank you again you too hey don't forget the, the police in Lee, New Hampshire, at the newest colony, they found out there was a hole in the fence. The police are looking into it. <laughs> Hi. I'll tell you that again. Hurry up, Carla. We've got 30 seconds. Hi. Yeah, I'm calling in. I'm watching a TV show with Don Tibbetts on it. Yeah. That... Howdy. Never heard of him. You have a question? For... <laughs> you have a question for Tibbetts? This is Robin. Did you ever hear that guy, Tibbetts? Hey, Robin, thanks for calling in. Our buddy Jason is having problems, but you and I are still on it. Add a girl. Yes. Okay, I've got to cut you short. Call in the show next week. Peter, do you want to wrap it up? Uh, I'm good, everybody. I'm uh, three sheets to the wind. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> we'll see you next time. <laughs> <laughs>